Okay, so the sweater that we have, this is a uh, Port Authority. Perfect for any type of customization. This brand is very good to work with. Okay, because you have the option to personalize a lot of locations. So you have pockets here, then you open it up. Okay, you have all these options. Front, left, right, back. Okay, sides. All right, but today, what we're gonna work on, we're gonna work on the back. Okay, this back side. So we're gonna put text up here with a design down in the bottom. These are the line it up rulers. Okay, so you got it right here. And the way these work, you got the center line, the zero, and then it numbers them out going outward, okay? We have that, and then I have uh, the water soluble pin here to show my mark. Now this easily comes off, okay? We, we use the Tide pen, but you could also use just regular water, and these marks come off. All right, so let's go ahead and cut this uh, backing real quick all right so this is uh, black backing just to match the color of the sweater all right so I have a piece a 12 by 16 that should fit this area here and these are here my Fiskars all right they're just easy nice blades that cut all right this is my cutting board here all right so it's just a little cheap all right your regular tables but it takes a beating all right so i like to use it i like to use these tables these are just your regular costco tables all right so now that we have our backing okay place it okay all right we're good here okay okay now let's go ahead Hoop up the sweater. Now, we want to put topping. Since it's a fleece, we want to make sure we put our topping. Since this is going to be text, I usually like to put topping on top of text. Okay. ready to go and bam now this line yep this line's going straight down here all right we're good to go let's take it to the machine and then start embroidering this first part all right let's go okay we have it hooped up and we are centered we are ready to go let's take one more look All right. Okay, let's go ahead and begin our second part of the back design. Okay, so I have this extra piece of cutaway that I have ready to go. Okay, I'm just gonna tape it could tape this top part this part I could just leave it all right okay I'm just taping it because I had extra piece of backing okay now let's go ahead and hoop up the sweater so let me move the camera a little there all right so all right so our design is eight inches so let me just make sure we'll be good all right, the bars down here. Big tabs here, I want the opening down here. All right, so, bam. All right, so, measure line, my straight line going straight down through my two reference. All right, I could use the text as a reference too. 
Okay, so I got it clipped. Always make sure nothing is caught up inside. All right. Everything looks nice and fresh. And I like to, uh, to embroider with the sleeves hanging down frontward, okay? So if you do that, just make sure you flip your design, okay? All right, there you go. Got it cleaned up, ready to go. All right, it's looking very, very nice and clean. Got number one here, number two here. All right, so we're ready to pack this up, send it out. But it's looking nice, nice, nice and clean and fresh. All right, let's get a little zoom in, zoom in. All right. There you go, right there. All right, nice clean quality. All right, and there you go. Okay, thank you for checking out today's project. Make sure you subscribe because we have tons and tons of projects coming up. All right, and if you have any recommendation on anything you wanna see, let us know down below. All right, till next time, peace.